Welcome back to Let's Play Shadow the Edgehog, Episode 10. To have knowledge of my past. Do you think people are bored of us saying Edgehog yet? I hope not, because I think it's a great joke. Uh, it is, but you know there's going to be that one Sonic fan that goes, It's a Hedgehog, not an Edgehog! Well, I could be Cockney for all you know. Oi, let's play some Shadow the Edgehog! Uh, that is a good point. I don't think I'm drunk or British enough to enjoy the Edgehog. I may be British enough, if I trace it back enough, but uh, definitely not drunk enough right now. Right. Yes, I went through cyberspace, met with the cast of Reboot, and now there are only four Chaos Emeralds left. I had someone bring up a good point. What the fuck was Rouge doing in there? I d That's what I was wondering! Maybe she found a way to go through cyberspace. I'm thinking because she's a government spy, she's there to update something or whatever. Yes, but how and does she get digitized? Yes, yes, we've seen this one from, uh, Professor, uh, Professor, President OTP. <laughs> he could also be a professor, maybe, maybe in his back room, like in his secret White House facility, he's trying to make Hedgehog's mate. Well, I don't know, I don't know if he has a degree in anything. He could have a degree in botany, for all I know. He's currently making the six degrees of Shadow the Edgehog. Isn't that Fifty Shades of Shadow? <laughs> oh, please. Can tell me about those black creatures. I need you to sign a contract. <laughs> and then he took off his shirt. And then it was really hot. So, okay. There goes Eggman. Eggman can help us. Let's go check out Eggman. So here we are in Cryptic Castle. Cryptic? Or as I like to call it... Pumpkin Hill. <gasps> I thought I, I saw something in the thumbnail. The doctor must have gone this way. The uh, thumbnail for the raw footage, that is. So oh, right, we got, right, right. we can either escape, light the lanterns, or find cream. Find cream. <laughs> all right, all right, Aggie. Yeah. Okay. All right, light the giant lanterns. Got it. <laughs> Whoa. <laughs> what happened? Yeah. Either Shadow's very strong, or these doors are actually made out of. Lincoln Logs. Maybe both. Amy, what are you doing here? So, yeah, we gotta go with Amy for a little bit, and now you may see that uh, we have to save Cream, but there is zero out of two. There's two creams, or is it cream and cheese? Ah, there you go. See, that's talking like a Sonic fan. Oh, no! I've become one of them! <laughs> oh, God! So, whoa! Ah! Define <coughs> physics with Eggman balloons. Or pumpkin balloons. Woo! Yeah, these balloons go on a set path and you can jump off whenever you want, but when you're supposed to jump off is, well, that's a whole other story. Where am I going? <laughs> what oh, the back fuck? To the beginning. No, that, no. Uh, no. What? Okay. Oh, okay. I thought. <laughs> this is like Halloween Town. Okay, so maybe it's more Halloween Town than Pumpkin Hill. But look at all the pumpkins! Yeah, I'll, I'll take it. I'll take Pumpkin Hill. I want to go back. Take me back, rap. I ain't gonna let it get to me. I'm just gonna creep. Dad of Pumpkin Hill, I guess, to find <laughs> the five lanterns. Oh, God. So, here's a gimmick for this stage. There are these blue fire lanterns. And we light these lanterns, and then stuff happens. Whoa. This is also how we light the lanterns for Eggman here. Oh, okay. Hey, Shadow! I'm a little bit fucked! Can you help me? <laughs> Have a little fun on the dark side, Shadow, by lighting the lanterns. Oh, giant lanterns. So wait, you gotta jump in face first with fire? Uh, no, that was just an oversight on my part. Oh, okay. I mean, I wasn't gonna say anything. You, you could have just said, oh yeah, this, this game's really weird, isn't it? <laughs> You'd believe it, though, wouldn't you? Yeah, probably. It's like, oh, at this Sonic point. Team, did, did anybody play test this game? God, Yuji Naka, what is your problem? So everyone makes that joke, I'm sure. It's like, oh my god, did they really play this game? And uh, I will say, yes, they did play this game to the fact that it worked. They didn't play this game to make it fun. <laughs> it's like, sir, uh, I noticed that most of the game, in fact, about 78% of the game seems kind of boring and dull. Uh, can we do anything about that? When's the deadline? About a month? Fuck no. Fuck it, boy, ship it! <laughs> we're, right. we're already in too deep, we gotta ship it. No matter how it is now. Amy, go away. Oh, get... 
just so, evaporates. Answer me this. Okay. We've got these bombs here, right? Mm -hmm. What if I told you they're useless? Are you ready? So they're just there. The cannon's crosshairs? What are you talking about? What, what, is there a cannon back here I didn't know about? Do, do I put the bombs in a ca you know, you know, never mind. Did you break the stage? I don't know. Because you're getting like a cannon out of nowhere. You got bombs that are absolutely useless. So I'm trying to hold on to this torch and see if I can uh, just keep it for the whole stage. But I can't because now we're on a forced rail segment. Oh, okay. Make this thing dive, huh? <laughs> I think Shadow knows exactly what it is. Excuse me, it's a Blaticus Burticus. I was just thinking the Blaticus Burticus goes, I have a name! <laughs> it's Fred! It's Fred, my friend, the Blaticus Burticus. Shadow, use that Blaticus Burticus to get out of the way. Use the control stick to move up and down. No, no, he already had this. Oh, uh, no. Wow. My ca your castle doesn't scare me at all. In fact, it kind of annoys me more than anything else. How annoying is it? Well, <laughs> this place is huge. I just realized. It's before your eyes. Anyway. Eggman's been yelling this whole time, just useless information. <laughs> it's like, shut the hell up! <laughs> Let me enjoy the atmosphere! Jeez! <laughs> well, they talk when you say helpful stuff. <laughs> oh! <laughs> <laughs> oh man, that will never get old. Oh, Thank you. Whoa! <laughs> I bet you were thinking, you know what? This level's kind of boring so far. I better spice it up by killing myself. Yeah, you know, uh, I'm doing too well. I need to make it more like me. <laughs> <laughs> I need to treat it like a modern Sonic game. Okay, <laughs> let's just go ahead and jump off the cliff. <laughs> this level still isn't too bad because at least I'm moving. And at least, uh, the lanterns aren't that difficult to find. It's the ones where I have to kill all the enemies. That's where it really starts to get painful. Those are terrible. Yeah, they are terrible. They're very uh, terrible. It's, uh, it's two of five. Okay. Kind of couldn't that. read that. I thought that was a lantern or something, but I think that's just decoration. I want to get that, but there we go. There we go. And boing. There's the locked door. One of these days we'll open one of those, Ooh. I hope. Have any fire? <laughs> Shut up! I'm trying to enjoy the level here! Huh? It's like even when you try to enjoy the game, the character says, Nope, you're not allowed! Try using the bounce pad! So, so here's where the what? weapon the, the bombs become useless. There's these these uh, walls with cracks in them, but yeah. if you think you need a bomb, you can just roll through it. Just doesn't matter. Wait. It's a dead end. Is it? Is it? I don't know. Is it? Why, why don't you tell me, Eggman? <laughs> it said use the X button to pick it up. What do I press? I press the fucking X button. But hey, I just press the X button to go through the fucking just. Oh, that was close. Um. Why do you have this in your castle? So we open this room over here, which leads to uh, another corridor that, uh, oh, it has a bomb in it and a pumpkin man. But a bomb! It's a dead end, or is it? Huh? See if I can try and, well, fuck it. <laughs> fuck All right, up. whatever. Guess so I'll just take this, because I bet we'll need it at some point. Get eight of that. There's the wall there. You can just roll through it. You don't even need the bomb. So, uh, we, we want to introduce a brand new mechanic with the bombs. Uh, just in case they don't work, should we put in a fail safe? Like, like what, what do you mean? I mean, it should work. I mean, we, we've been programming this for years. It should be perfect, right? Well, I'd rather us, uh, 
not use the bomb than have to use the bomb, you know? Like, at least there's a way to break open the walls without anything yeah. like that. So Thank that's good, God. that's good. Yeah. Aha! There's a whole bunch- there's a whole shit ton of chow here! Why? So you can just stand here and just use- yeah. Oh no, the chows are everywhere. Do they believe so, in their lord and savior? What, did you make? Yes. Or do they believe in the anti-god Shithy? What? Oh. 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 Oh! Okay. Oh! Oh, alright, alright. Oh, that's a thing! It, there you go. It's, well, it's a good thing you still have the fire. Oh, oh. Okay, okay. Uh, well, go the other Alright, go the other- Oh, look at that face! Look at that pumpkin face! <laughs> <laughs> Hope you all feeling pretty <laughs> left today! <laughs> You, there we go. How do you feel today, left wing or right wing? <laughs> oh my lord. Stop! <laughs> I normally don't complain about tutorials this much, but it's been every single thing we have seen! This is episode 10, we kind of know how the game works by now. At least I should hope so, and plus, but this is the third part of Shadow's, like, ultimate evil story. Of course we know what to do. Maybe we should figure it out on our own or something, I don't know. I don't know. This is only the second time we know of this, so now we gotta remember that there's health now? Oh shit, there is? Yeah. Oh wow, I didn't even notice. I feel like they could have said this in the first part or something. Nah. They were, but they were talking about controlling it too, it's just... Why don't you let the player just just experiment and all that, maybe? Oh hey, look. A key. Fucking A. Oh, cool. Well, keep that in the back of my mind for later. Oh, hi. I think bats flew out of his eyes and nose. That was cool. I like that. Alright, so here's the uh, fourth lantern. And... Oh, uh, no. Oh, no. Uh, Alright, so, uh, backtracking. Let's see. Oh, wait. There's another spot? Yeah, a couple of spots we missed, so, like... Did I miss something back here, or... Hmm. Can't really get back there now, can I? Oh, boy. <sighs> so, how's your day been? Oh, it's going great. Breath of the Wild came out. Yeah, that's a, that's a cool thing. I'm jizzing myself along with everybody else. Mm, okay. It's, uh, you know, like, but there are a few issues, so I can only give it a 14 out of 10, unfortunately. Oh, well, that that seems very fair. I mean, when a game has a problem, you sh shouldn't let it slide. Exactly, and I, I gotta be firm in my decision. Mm -hmm. Only a 14 out of 10. Maybe oh even a 13.5. <sighs> I mean, just hey, as long as you're not like IGN. What'd they give it? Oh, the perfect 10. I'm, I'm just saying. <laughs> I mean, uh, God, I, you're, just you're, a 10? Wow, really can't spell ignorant without IGN, can ya? <laughs> Yes. I'm actually surprised GameSpot gave it a 10, because they hate games. They hate games and they love Zelda. They love open world games too, and it just felt like this is a Zelda game finally joining the grown up world in video games, you know? They actually, they love Kane and Lynch too. <laughs> yeah, dude. <laughs> Everybody oh, should love Kane and Lynch. Oh, fuck my life in the ass! Good God. Ah! All right. All right, fine. We'll just start the whole level over again. And now Eggman's gonna repeat everything he said. Oh no! <laughs> you can jump on that and learn to grind your way down. I think that's what he said. I seriously doubt it, but whatever. I just want to play that goodbye doctor thing again. <laughs> Every time he says something, goodbye doctor. Where are you going? The giant lantern is behind you! Goodbye, Doctor! <laughs> <laughs> Maybe that's why the shadow finally snaps. Oh. Uh. 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 Alright, well, uh. Wait, why luckily, would the barricades be back? Fortunately, the fifth lantern isn't that hard to find. Oh, good. I'll give was you a hint. It, it's nearby. It, was it just on the left side? No, n nothing that simple. But it oh, was. Okay. It was a mistake on my part, and it is, it, it is here. So, oh, what okay. you're supposed to do 
because both of those rails lead you right back here, but you're supposed to go up this center one. Really? Yep. See, I, I thought that was just a pathway, but no, that's a way forward. Oh, uh, look at that! Like that, lantern. That makes a ball appear. Oh. And then, oh, look at that shit. Oh my god, it we're done. done. It wasn't too bad, was it? Only 11 minutes, you know. Could have. I'm one step closer to could have been. Could have been better. Could have been worse. Kind of in the middle, I'd say. Why did this need to happen? Like lighting the lantern. What did that accomplish? Oof. That that activated his security system or something like that. I don't know. Why wouldn't he just have fire readily available next to his like Halloween pumpkin castle? Doesn't he have robots everywhere? Can't they just light the lanterns for him? Is are we really bringing logic into this? Well, of course. In fact, here's this for logic. Ooh, that looks cool. Betrayal. What are you doing here? What? Doctor, I don't want to fight with you, but I need those chaos emeralds. They hold the secret to my. Enough of this nonsense. Goodbye, Doctor. <laughs> oh, betrayal. A backstab from Eggman? I never would have seen it coming. Way to go, knucklehead! <laughs> oh, you almost did. Oh, well, he's, uh... okay, I love this. Huh? Wazzaw! <laughs> Wazzaw! Eggbreaker! Right, so this is Eggbreaker, let's go break an egg. Oh, hi, okay. Amy. Sorry I didn't save your friend. She's probably dead, oh well. Oh well, you know, a pleasant sacrifice to the Halloween gods. So, first things first, let's get a gun. Whoop. <laughs> I can just okay. see cream and cheese be being held captive by Oogie Boogie. <laughs> <laughs> just in the basement of Halloween Town. The just sound of the dice is music in the air. It's like a gambling boogie man. Although I don't play. But cream always wins, so. He's like, I don't understand this. How does she always <laughs> roll seven every time? Give me all your bugs, Boogie Man! I wanna go and put everything on double zero! <laughs> There's no way it's gonna be on double zero spins and it's on double zero. How the hell? <laughs> Jack finally gets there and he sees the Boogie Man unraveled, just bugs everywhere, and he's going, What on earth happened? <laughs> so, okay, we got enough uh, bullets to last us a while. We got like 58, and the thing is, well. His weak point's always right there. He's always vulnerable, so, uh, yeah. Uh, that's... Why would they put this here? That's pitiful. That's so pitiful. <laughs> oh, God. God. Light on my lanterns. Now, quickly, beat me in the easiest boss fight in the game so far. Sorry, doctor. You know, besides the general of Black Doom's army. That's what you get for betraying Shadow the Hedgehog. Yeah, and there's an A rank. Nice job. Perfect. Oh, I mean, uh, average. Yeah, it could be. Yeah. Could be a double S rank. Those exist? I, no, they don't exist. Oh, damn it. You got my hopes up. Oh. Mr. President, there's an emergency. What now? It seems as if Some creamsicles trying to run for office. But apparently enemy reinforcements have it's actually cream, but she's frozen. <laughs> Look, it's a creamsicle. How? How can this be? <laughs> Runs to his secret vault to protect his OTP. All right, so time for the next level. And well, this isn't really all that fun either. Central City is not fun. No, it's not fun at all. Because. No. <laughs> Well, uh, let's just, uh, have Shadow here have his moment. Let me share with you a piece of your past. It's feeling that nothing but hate. Green Day, 1977, or 1997. Hatred and contempt for the humans. You were the ultimate rifle, <laughs> but the humans... Yeah, that's how I feel, Shadow. I'm falling asleep right now. And Boring. My favorite song from American Idiot was Letterbomb. Okay. So, yeah, we got eight minutes to do either the good or the bad mission. Detonate the massive bomb 
before okay. time is out. So set off the giant bomb somehow does, you know, I'm thinking, okay, just go for the one. But no, there's five. What? But it says detonate the giant bomb. I, I know, right? This was... But Signifying one. Doing good's no better because you have to get 40 smaller bombs in that case. Whoa, what? It's fucking ridiculous. Jesus. I mean, oh. Jesus. I mean, what worse can go wrong? Oh, no. Oh, no! Damn it. Hmm. I think that means it's time to stop. So, of wondering. course, we're not stopping, and we'll see you next time on Let's Play Shadow the Hedgehog. Does not compute. Does not compute. 40 smaller bombs. 5 large bombs. Good. Crash.